The very first day that Harley came to the house, it was like in the movies, in slow motion. <laughs> they like stared at each other and ran into each other's arms. It was instantly love. Kai was my lifeline. We were inseparable. We kind of helped each other through our difficult times. Kai, come here. Good boy. Speak. One more, speak. I got Kai to help me cope because when I came back from Afghanistan, I was officially diagnosed with PTSD. I had night terrors and nightmares, always scanning around, being hypervigilant. But Kai always had my back. I couldn't imagine he was deliberately stolen. The first time I did chemotherapy, I got very sick. I wasn't eating. Harley would lay next to me when I was feeling at my worst. He was there for me. Huey had been used as bait for dog fighting. He was just so broken down. It drew me close to him, and I just thought, I'm not going to let this dog give up. He's broken, and I'm broken. But that doesn't mean that it's over. The search continues in the North County tonight for a missing service dog. He's all that I have, and now I don't have that. I feel like my world is falling apart. Fate is fate, but just that desire, just that drive to live makes all the difference in the world, and we were gonna fight for this. The dogs we love and who love us stay with us forever. The pain of loss is an echo of how connected we truly are. They're in our DNA, as are we in theirs. There's no life that can't be made better by the love of a dog.